both combinations and permutations there is a word hospitality in this there are level letters without any restriction these level letters can be arranged in 11 factorial by 2 factorial into 2 factorial because two t's are there and two i's are there these two are alike and these two are alike therefore all the level letters can be arranged in a row in 11 factorial by 2 factorial into 2 factorial ways suppose i want to make words with some of the letters of this word so how many five letter words can be formed using the letters of the given word actually we need only five out of this level which five here all are not different if all are different there is no problem just 11 p5 but here all are not different that's why we have to take cases how to discuss that that we'll see now before going to that first let us see availability how many letters are there specifically like this these are all only one time these two times this two times and these two times a five letter words so in solving this problem we are following one method that is i am dividing the problem into two parts that is one selection of five letters after selecting then we will arrange them first in this selection in different cases i can select because the because of the availability in case one i'll select in such a way five letters i am selecting two of the same two of the same and one different two same letters two same letters and one different letter this is the case and uh, second case is two same and three different letters here also we are getting five letters case 3 is three same is not possible because maximum two only can be same so two same two same is over one pair is there and three different now all different all five are different so these are the cases no other case is available according to this one now in this case one i have to select two same two same and one different letter so number of ways of selection into arranging them will give you the number of five letter words in this case so selection number of ways of selection i have to tell select two same two same so i have to select all these these two i's and two t's there is no other go for me so that is only one way and one way and one different letter for one different letter we have 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 letters are there out of 7 i have to select only one that can be done in 7c1 so with this the selection is over after this selection i have five letters in which two are same two are same and one is different we know all the five letters can be arranged in five factorial when two are same two are same this is the way so 7 into 30 210 two ten words of five letters in which two same two same and one different letter can be formed let us come to the second case here also number of ways of selecting and arranging them this is my first part of the job and this is my second part of the job selection here i have to select two same letters and three different letters i have here 
I can select either two Y's or two T's. So any one of them I can select. That can be done in two C1 ways. So one of them is selected. So I have two letters with me. That two same letters. Now three different letters I have to select. What is the availability here now? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 and 8. One of them is left. So 8 are there. So out of 8 I have to select only 3. So 8 C3 ways. So selection is over. Here we have 3 different letters and 2 same letters. 5 letters can be arranged in 5 factorial by 2 factorial that comes out to be 2 into 8 C3, 8 into 7 into 6 by 3 factorial into this is 60, 120 into 56. This is the number of 5 letter words in the second case. Now third case, again I have to select and arrange number of ways of selection into number of ways of arranging them. What I have to select now? Five different letters. All five are different. Now let us see how many different letters are there with me. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. 9 different letters. From this one I will select, from this one I will select. So 9 different letters are there. Out of 9, I have to select 9C5 into, they can be arranged in 5 factorial. This is nothing but 9P5. So, now the total number of 5 letter words is the total number of 5 letter words is 210 plus 120 into 56 plus 90. So of course, this calculation we can do easily. So, this is the way of doing. In this, uh, we used both combinations and permutation. So, here in each case, first selection and then arrangement. So, in this way, this problem is to be done. Very good example for both combinations and permutations are used. Okay. There is one letter, one word intermediate. See here, I is or 1, 2, N is 1, T is 1, 2 and E is 1, 2, 3 and R is 1, M is 1, D is 1 and A is 1. Okay, now how many four letter words can be formed from this? Find the number of four letter words. Four letter words. Here also we have to take the cases. In this, uh, one important thing is that the availability. Two I's are there, two T's are there and uh, three E's are there. These five letters are single. So, in case, again here also I have to take cases, case 1. Now, first case I can take 3 same, 1 different. 3 same and 1 different letter. Case 2, I will take 2 same, 2 same. Because in these 3, any 2 if I select 2 same, 2 same I can get. And case 3, 2 same, two different and case four all four are different. First of all whenever you write uh, all the cases you should write you should not miss any case that is why first write the cases and then in each case let us do the problem. Now it is simple now again in each case number of ways of selecting the words and then arranging them here. 3 same and 1 different. 3 same means only one choice is there for us. That is only one way. All 3 E's are selected. Now for the different letter, one different letter, we have 